everybody, what's going on? I am Greg Sussman, joined today by Tom Vecchio of FanDuel, here to break down tonight's NBA DFS slate. What's going on, Tom? I'm doing good. Big 10 NBA games tonight, playing basketball, whether it's NBA or college. Let's go. But tonight, we're going to be watching the Portland Trailblazers take on the Dallas Mavericks, specifically for Luka Doncic. Luka is priced at $10,400 tonight against Damian Lillard and the Blazers. Blazers are four-point underdogs. Here, you like Luka and the Mavs. How come? We have a 234-point over-under, and the Trailblazers are coming off a win last night, but this makes their third game in four days. Maybe some tired legs, and I think that Luka can take advantage of that. Not just because of that, but because Portland is dead last in the league when it comes to FanDuel points allowed per game to opposing point guards, sitting at 51.69. We already know that Luka's producing 1.49 FanDuel points per minute on a 35.9% usage rate. So we have a super high over-under. We have a great usage rate. We have playing production from Luka, hopefully seeing those 70 points that we saw from him the other night against the Clippers. So I'm going back to Luka the Don tonight. With the Blazers playing so many games recently, Luka a bit more rested and a bit more ready here at $10,400 to hopefully dominate your lineups here in this matchup against Portland. Up next, let's go to a bigger guy, specifically a huge player in Nikola Vucevic. Vuce is priced at $9,700 for the Magic, facing off against a Brooklyn Nets team. The Nets, they're big-time favorites. The Magic are coming on the second night of a back-to-back, but you like Vuce in this spot. The Nets have obviously struggled defensively, specifically against big men. Exactly. They're allowing the third most fan points per game in opposing center, sitting at 55.88. $9,700 for Vooch tonight. That's $1,300 cheaper compared to Jokic, which I think is a considerable amount of savings when we're getting you know, somewhat of a similar production. I'll say that you know, Jokic will always have the higher ceiling, being able to push towards 70 points more consistently. But we still can get 50-plus out of Vucevic tonight. He's producing 1.39 FanDuel points per minute on a usage rate over 30%. It's a pace-up spot for Orlando. They're 22nd in the league, uh, going up to the Nets that are 8th, not playing a whole lot of defense. I want to take the $1,300 of savings and use that elsewhere on tonight's slate. Lots of like here with Nikola Vucevic, who's should be in a good spot, under $10,000 this evening. One final player to get to, and that brings us to the Boston Celtics, and specifically with Jason Tatum. Tatum is priced even cheaper than both Doncic and Vucevic, as he's under $9,000 tonight here at 8900 Since the All-Star break, Tatum has been a bit inconsistent. Hopefully that changes tonight against the Sacramento Kings. If there's any spot for him to get right, it's against the Kings, who don't like to play defense this year. We have a 234-point over-under, and that's kind of the uh, normal situation we see for the Kings over the past few games on this East Coast road trip. Just plenty of points from their opponents. And if that's the case, I want to be looking at Tatum, who, who, as you said, is under $9,000, a very solid 32% usage rate for him. We're looking at 234-point over-under. I'm expecting 40-plus, if not 50-plus points from Tatum tonight. The Celtics have been struggling a bit this season, specifically on defense, so the back-and-forth potential is certainly there. But I'll take Tatum with his 1.30 fan points per minute, going up against the Kings defense that looks more like Jester's. Folks, he wrote that line last night and had a huge smile on his face. The Kings look like jesters on defense. Mainly, that's great for Jason Tatum. Price tonight under $9,000, a get-right spot for him. So get him in there, along with Vooch and along with Doncic. You want to win some money on a FanDuel tonight. That's going to do it for us here at the FanDuel. Hurry up, Tom. We appreciate the time. Come up with more fantastic content this weekend, will you? Same to you. I'll see you again next week. Absolutely. Enjoy the madness of March. We can't wait to talk more about it next week. For Tom Vecchio, I'm Greg Sussman. Have a fantastic weekend, and I'll see you back here on Monday for another edition of the FanDuel Hurry Up.